New research suggests transcatheter aortic valve replacement, also known as TAVR, shows a survival advantage over open heart surgery. Cronkite News reporter Mariah Hickerson spoke to a doctor who says this TAVR may become the new standard of care. 93-year-old Charles Lusk has suffered from heart problems for most of his life. Doctors felt open heart surgery was too risky for a man his age, and he was against it as well. When they first started talking about heart surgery, I told them to forget it. I'd rather, rather die of natural causes. <laughs> but after learning about the TAVR procedure, he decided to give it a try in January. Well, ironically, I, just, I had to keep reminding myself that I'd had surgery. I, I did not feel anything. The procedure took place at Abrazo's Arrowhead Hospital. Lusk's surgeon says the procedure is minimally invasive. Uh, this is a good device. It's life-saving for them. The device is loaded in a catheter. It's then threaded up through the groin and threaded across your aortic valve. And when the valve is released, it stents open the existing diseased leaflets. So in my view, uh, going forward in the future, I think that this is going to become the standard of care. And as for Lusk, he has no complaints. I think I, it's a great, great way to go. Weeks after the procedure, he was back singing with his church choir. In Glendale, Mariah Hickerson, Cronkite News. The American College of Cardiology concluded the long-term prognosis, TAVR patients is favorable, but are still doing further research.